In Luke 10, 38, 39, it says, As Jesus and the disciples continued on their journey, they came to a village where a woman welcomed Jesus into her home. Her name was Martha, and she had a sister named Mary. Mary sat down attentively before the master, absorbing every revelation he shared. But Martha became exasperated with finishing the numerous household chores. So she interrupted Jesus. Lord, don't you think it's unfair that my sister left me to do all the work by myself? The Lord answered her, Martha, my beloved Martha, why are you upset and troubled, pulled away by all of these many distractions? Mary has discovered the one thing most important by choosing to sit at my feet. She is undistracted and I won't take this privilege from her in this world and there are things that we need to do but if those things become a priority in our life we become Martha and we become distracted by many distractions it becomes so consuming that we miss the fact that Jesus Christ is sitting in our living room who was having a good time at this gathering Mary why because she chose the good thing she was sitting at Jesus's feet absorbing every revelation he was sharing but in the natural, it looked like she was being lazy. But why didn't Martha just say, you know what, whatever. He can multiply fish and loaves. I, I just, I want to sit because God is in my living room. God is in my living room. I'm here to tell you the older sister is the law. The older sister is religion. Works without power. Works without affection. Works without love. But Jesus, who is grace, was saying, the kingdom has come. You should be all ears, Martha. I'm here to give you the kingdom. Don't be distracted. Don't be lured into the old things. Come into the new. Come in where there's life. Come in where there's love. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.